uh, the future looks quite bleak at I think moment, at the moment. Yeah. and I don't think she's the person to really care or do anything positive really she seems a bit wishy-washy not keen on either of them to be honest whoever got in I preferred Boris oh well she's gonna be a disaster 12 years of Tories and what have they done to this country? I mean, we're in a cost of living crisis now and they'd be, they could have done something for the last 12 years. They could have dealt with the energy crisis for the last 12 years, could have dealt with the housing crisis for the last 12 years, but they haven't got any new ideas. Replace the leader all you want, but it's the same people, it's the same Tories every time. I can't see hope with Liz Truss, no, because I think, I, I, I basically don't see her as an intelligent person. She has, she, 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 she can't make decisions, she changes her mind, she, she can't think on her feet, she can't answer questions. Um, yeah, I, I, I can't see any hope. And that's how I see her, an out-of-touch woman who uh, doesn't really care and is self-seeking, ambitious. She's got what she wants and I'll be very interested to see what she does now she's in power. No, I don't think there'll be much, much change. Much change. Mm. To be honest, I was disappointed when I heard the news. I really was. I think uh, straight away I just thought female Boris. And I'm not a fan of Boris. Um, I think she's tripped herself up many times, really. Uh, but I've got to give her the benefit of the doubt. You know, the Conservative Party have voted for her, so let's see how it goes. So it doesn't matter to me who's in charge because it'll be the same old, same old, um, in my opinion.